The first process we make the detail like this one, awesome. and then this is waxing process. They put the detail, and come like this one, and this for the first color with the dye process. After they dye, we get the blue one. The first color is blue, and then we boiling to removing the wax, and then underneath the wax stay in white in here, and then they put wax for the second time. They put in here. Like this one, and then they put uh, the second color here is brown, and then this after they boiling underneath the wax stay in white in here. Uh, what is she doing here? Is it handmade? Yeah, this is a handmade. All is handmade. In our factory, we have three kinds of batik. First is handmade, or we call it batik tulis, and then the second hand stamping batik process in there, and then the third is combination by hand and stamp. We have many patterns on the paper like that one. We have special art piece for my that motif. And then he just copying on the paper. After they make the design, the next process is waxing process. Okay. For the first process, for the first process, we put the wax on the basic motif on the pencil line like this one, and then she put the detail inside the motif, so it become like this one. See, the motif is more details. So yeah. And then for this motif, for the detail motif, it's with our creation, our imagination. So that's why for the writing body process, we don't have the same pattern, yeah, for this video. Yeah, and this is a combination. Combination body kits mean this motif we do by stamp. But for the details and for the finishing, we do by hand. For the coloring process, we have two methods. The first method, if we need the variation color like this one, the detail color, they do by hand like that one. So we paint one by one. And then the second, they put on the back in there with the dry process. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> These are the stuffs. So through time, uh, you have uh, collected so many. Yeah. Oh. Wow, look at that. What is the uh, material of the stamp? Copper. Copper stamp. Ah, copper. So they last forever. Yeah. yeah. Wow, these are classics. Yeah. <laughs> very, um, very expensive. They're treasures. Yeah. Okay, now we can go there to see how we remove the wax. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This is the crayon for the wax, but it's made from paraffin, beeswax, and animal fat. Okay. Yeah, and this is for make the natural dye. Yeah, for make the natural color. This wood be boiling, and then the water we use for make the color. That is a boiling process to remove the wax. In inside we have many pieces with different color. We put together. And then we boiling about 20 until 30 minutes until all the wax is removed. Yeah. And then boiling process only for cotton material. Yeah? And then for the silk one, we use benzene. So we just put on the benzene for the silver. Okay, and then after the boiling, we wash it with the water and then we dry it. Yeah, that wow, is beautiful process. Yeah, okay, for the hair writing batik process, we need until a month. Depend the colors and the motif. Yeah. More colorful, more detail, is more longer process. Yeah. But so, uh, how many people are walking here? Doing here yeah, in here, it's about 20. 20 and then two months? Uh, two months to make one? Yeah, <laughs> months, yeah. At least months. So the 20. Wow. But sometimes they do at home also. Ah, okay. Yeah, they take at home. This is all done by hand, and this is for make a rabbit skirt.
Is this all? Uh, all done by him. All uh, Yogi Yaga, uh, Yog Yog Jakarta style. You know. No, this motif is more modern motif. Modern. Yes. The traditional color and motif is like this one. Ah, this okay. is the traditional motif, yeah. Like this kind.